Hello, welcome to Microbiology Classes in this video. We will discuss about germ theory of diseases in microbiology. First, what is germ theory of disease? Germ theory of disease is a theory that says certain diseases are caused by the invasion of body by microorganisms such as bacteria, virus, fungi, protozoans. These are all invisible with our naked eye. We can observe these only under microscope. These diseases are caused by the reproduction and growth of these microorganisms in our body. The germ theory of disease was proposed by scientist Louis Pasteur. Pasteur conducted various experiments to demonstrate the relationship between diseases and microorganisms. Next, history of germ theory of disease. In ancient times, people believed that these diseases are caused by some bad spirits that are present inside the body. They believed in the supernatural theory of disease. For example, smallpox, chickenpox, cholera, these diseases were assumed to be inflicted as a curse of some angry goddess. Before this germ theory of disease, there was mismatic theory was prevalent. This mismatic theory says that diseases are caused by noxious air, that means contaminated air and vapors. For example, to this, the malaria disease. Louis Pasteur demonstrated the diseases are caused by sorry, diseases are caused by inhaling bad air. The reason for this is that bad air has bacteria. He stated that. And in 1877, Another scientist called Robert Koch demonstrated that the causative organism for anthrax disease was a bacterium. Louis Pasteur and Koch's experiments findings showed that microorganisms were caused for diseases. These came to be known as germ theory of disease. Louis Pasteur he discovered the pathology of pyogenic vibrio in blood and pure peril fever and he introducing using a boric acid to kill these microorganisms. Coach perfected the technique of identification including the use of solid media and the use of stain. Coach after identifying the tubercle bacillus that in, is in the shape of rod he formalized the criteria and introduced these criteria are were introduced by Henley in 1840. But these criteria known as Coates postulates. Now let's look into the Coates postulates. Robert Coates stated that a certain disease is caused by specific organism. He isolated legends from anthrax infected host and conducted experiments on it. Then he formulated certain criteria. Those are the microbe must be pointed in the diseased host, not in the healthy one. The microorganism can be isolated and cultured and Introduction of these culture produces a similar disease in experiments on organisms and animals. And other works in the germ theory of disease. Edward Jenner in 1796, he introduced vaccination against smallpox disease using lesions of a similar disease in cattle cowpox. Next, Joseph Lister in 1860, he introduced antiseptic surgery. And Agostino Bassi in 1836, he demonstrated that a fungus was the cause of disease of silkworm. However, various members of the German school 
isolated microorganisms such as cholera vibrio typhoid bacillus diphtheria bacillus pneumococcus staphylococcus and etc disease about germ theory of disease thank you for watching if you like our video please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel and comment and share with your friends